welcome back to this channel so first of all just log in with your credentials and activate the cloud shell it will take a couple of seconds so just wait for that click on continue meanwhile just simply come on the task number one and copy this command click on got it let me increase the text size okay now run the first command click on authorize it will take a couple of seconds so just wait for that and it's done okay now just simply scroll down and click on check my progress you will get a score without any issue now for the task number two just copy this command paste over here scroll down copy this command and paste over here again scroll down now we are on the task number three copy the first command of task number three wait for to this command to get execute and it's done now run the first command of task number three then copy the second command of task number three and run now copy the third command and run just wait for a couple of seconds and it's done now what you have to do open this link in incognito window meanwhile just simply scroll down and here you can see from point number seven just copy this name click on create just replace that name with here make sure it must be single label okay no need to make any other changes just simply click on create now it will take a couple of seconds so just wait for that and if you just simply come over here and now what we have to do we have to just simply choose the select import files from cloud storage okay i will let you know what we have to do over here just wait for a couple of seconds and it's finally done now what you have to do uh, from here we have to choose a select import file from cloud storage choose the third option now click on the browse option just wait for a second and here you can see your project id and uh, dash vcm so just choose this click over here and from here choose the data.csv and click on select and now just simply click on continue now we have to wait at least five to six minutes sometimes it might take more than that just wait and once it's done you will get a score on the task number three so just wait a couple of minutes and let's see
and it's finally done now what you have to do just simply come over here and click on check my progress and you will get a score without any issue and that's the way we have to complete this lab if you still have any doubts please let me know in the comment section guys thanks for watching and have a good day